For Days of the Winter, we're going to read The Crown's Christmas by Drew DeWalt. The Crown's Christmas. I thought we talked about this. Drew by Drew DeWalt. One snowy December day, Duncan was making Christmas cards with his crowns when the mail carrier brought a letter, only it wasn't for him. From Mom and Dad to Peach Crown, Apartment 4, Crown Box, Duncan's Room on the bookshelf next to a weird pen holder. Christmas greetings from Florida. Oh, peachy pie. You always were my shy one. So I sent you some clothes. Now you can give Duncan back his underwear. Have fun playing dress up my naked baby. And Merry Christmas. Love, Mom. And here are the clothes that she sent for Peach. Duncan and his crown spent the next day playing in the snow. Yay, clothes. I think the snowman... No, it should be a banana. I don't care all at all what you think. I think it should be a carrot. Feeling snowed out, but suddenly very Christmassy. The crowns head inside to warm up and get out of the decor get out of the decorations. Christmas stuff. You know, I'm candy right now. Duncan, and you know you're supposed to eat candy, right? Because last time I checked, people didn't hang, hang candy on the tree. Tin Years in a row. I'm older than you are, kiddo. Now will someone please eat me and end this madness? For at last, I was in there a whole year, silver. The next day, as Duncan and the crowns decorated the house, they heard a knock on the door. Can I please not be on the back of the tree facing the wall this year? Oh, look at Mr. I'm a stocking. Oh, brother, I wish I'd melted to underwear instead. It was a mail carrier with another letter. This one was addressed to Beige Crown. Beige Senior, Raytown, Pennsylvania. Beige Crown, the crown box, top of the bookshelf, Duncan's room. Hello, Beige, my dear boy. I heard you're allergic to gluten now from coloring all that wheat, but don't worry. I'm sending you my world famous, top secret, gluten free Christmas cookies and hot cocoa recipe. Merry Christmas and lots of love, Dad. Dad's world famous top secret gluten free Christmas cookies and hot cocoa recipe. Go to store and buy gluten free cookies. <laughs> Step two, also go get hot co cocoa mix. Step three, follow instructions on hot cocoa box. Step four, add too much milk so it's it's a nice beige color. Maybe add a marshmallow. Step five, eat cookies with hot cocoa. The best step of all. And you know what? The next thing they made beige's dad world famous top secret gluten free Christmas cookies and hot cocoa. Ah, feel that stress just melt away. Just as they said that the cookies and cocoa, another letter came in. This one was from Gray Crown, who was away visiting the family. Gray Crown, Gray's Land, Tennessee. Duncan's Crown, the Crown Fort, wherever Duncan left it. Happy Hanukkah! Hey Duncan, sorry I won't be able to make it home this year. I'm celebrating Hanukkah with my family. If I don't, uh, if I don't, I always get a little sad and get and gray around the holidays. Ha! Get it a little gray because I'm a ne oh never mind. Anyway, here's a dreidel. Happy spinning, Merry Christmas, and Happy Hanukkah. Gray crown. Oh man, you win again. I don't know how you do it. A work of art, a triumph, a masterpiece, my greatest work, you know. Such a great present from Gray. The crowns remember they had some presents of their own to wrap. Deck the halls with lots of crowns. Ha, la 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 With the presents all wrapped, it was time to go caroling. Just as the crowns came home from caroling, the milk carrier delivered a big package for Chucky Toddler Crown. Oh, I ordered this Christmas gift online. That's how it works, right? You order gifts for yourself. No, it's not? Oh, sorry. Well, the good news is that we can all play with it. Open it up and see. The Great Crown Holiday Race. The simple goal is to get from start to finish. You roll a six-sided die and move on a counter that number of spaces. And if you had land on a special space, you follow the directions on the space and move your pieces accordingly. And this is what it looks like. The Great Crown Holiday Race. Fun times. Finally, it was Christmas Eve. Time for the big Christmas party. 
After the play, Anthony and the Night, there was a package waiting for them at the front door from the North Pole, but it wasn't from Santa. From Esteban, the Magnificent, and Neon Red, too. To Duncan and everyone at the back home, via airmail. Hey Duncan, remember how I always wanted to see the world and you know how you and you know how Neon Red is a total expert. Well, Neon Red has been taking me everywhere. Here's a map we made of our trip. We went We were hoping to get back before Christmas, but sadly we can't because we were helping this old guy light light his sleigh to deliver gifts to some kids he knows or whatever. Merry Christmas from far, far away. Love Esteban the Magnificent and Neon Red, also pretty magnificent. There we go. Like he was happy that his crowns received such wonderful gifts. All he, all he had were letters from Grey, Esteban, and Neon Red saying they wouldn't be home for Christmas. That made him sad and no one in the world noticed or cared. I love not being naked anymore. Merry Christmas, you old boiling savings and loan. It's a Christmas miracle. Except for the crowns. In this case, in this season of giving and they decided to give back to the boy who had always given them the respect and even a home. Merry Christmas, Duncan. Love from your crowns. God bless us, everyone. Yay, finally, the end.